big 3D adventures are often what comes to mind when thinking about Mario and Zelda today. Super Mario Odyssey and Breath of the Wild are both amazing, genre-defining games that absolutely deserve all the attention they get. But we can't forget that both of these series also have a strong and important legacy in a different genre. Both Zelda and Mario are series that came to prominence as 2D games platformers in the case of Mario, and for Zelda, top-down action-adventure games. In recent times, these 2D games serve as second heads of the IP, still important tentpoles of Nintendo's release schedule. So it's a pretty safe bet to assume that new 2D games for both series are currently in development. But how likely is it that we'll see one of these games soon? And what could a new 2D Mario or Zelda look like? These are the questions I'll be exploring today. First, let's think of the last 2D releases for each series. Zelda actually had its latest 2D adventure on Switch in 2019, The Link's Awakening remake. So it really hasn't been that long for 2D Zelda. Mario is in a similar situation, as there were also a couple of 2019 releases, New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe, and Super Mario Maker 2. So technically, it's only been about three years since the last release in each series. But Mario is a bit interesting, because Super Mario Maker 2 is a creative title that relies on user-generated levels, and New Super Mario Bros. U Deluxe is a re-release of the last original Mario play platformer, which originally released for Wii U in 2012. These are not what we would call traditional continuations of the franchise. There hasn't been a new traditional 2D Mario title for about a decade, and a similar thing could also be said for Zelda. Even though Link's Awakening was made in an entirely new 2D Zelda engine, it's still, at the end of the day, a remake of a classic game. The last fully original 2D Zelda was 2013's A Link Between Worlds. That is, if we're not counting 2015's multiplayer focus title, Triforce Heroes. Either way, it's been a while since we've gotten all new 2D entries in either of these series, and I think players would certainly welcome some fresh new takes on these staple Nintendo releases. The 2D Mario platformers could use an upgrade from the long-running New Super Mario Bros. style. Whether it's in art style, stage design, or mechanics, a brand new, innovative Mario platformer is what I want to see most. I'd love to see what Nintendo teams can do with this tried-and-true franchise in the modern era, because because without counting Mario Maker, there hasn't been an original 2D Mario platformer on Switch, so it's definitely about time. And while this idea might be more plausible on the Zelda side of things, there is also a chance that 2D Mario could come back to Switch as a remake. Now, I don't think this is particularly likely, but I also don't think it's impossible. There is a chance we could see something like a Super Mario World remake come to Switch one day. Out of all the potential candidates for a 2D Mario remake, Super Mario World is probably the most substantial classic title they could use, and really the only one I could see Nintendo making a full-on remake and selling it as a $60 release. When it comes to Zelda, we're also in need of an original 2D game. Like I said earlier, it's been quite a long time since an original Zelda was crafted from the top-down perspective. So, similarly to Mario, I'd love to see what Nintendo could do with the franchise modern day. And I'm definitely not alone in saying this. Plus, Zelda is arguably even more welcoming to cool new gameplay innovations because of the fantasy adventure nature of the games. In Zelda, there's a lot of freedom for the game concept, whereas 2D Mario could be a bit more rigid and predefined. But despite this, there's another thing to consider. Traditionally, Zelda remakes are generally very well received by the fanbase. The classic Zeldas are so beloved that we can never discount remakes as a possibility, and any sort of Zelda remake will more than likely be a hot seller for Nintendo. One of the most talked about potential Zelda remakes are the Oracle games from the Game Boy Color. The Legend of Zelda, Oracle of Seasons, and Oracle of Ages are, in my opinion, great choices for a remake. These sometimes forgotten handheld games could be beautified and expanded really nicely on a home console. And these two are already very similar to the fellow Game Boy title Link's Awakening, which we already know worked well on Switch. I'd find it hard to believe Oracle remakes won't happen one day. My only question is, which one of the two versions would be remade? Ages or Seasons? Or perhaps Nintendo could use the Pokemon approach and release two versions simultaneously. Now I think that is an amazing idea. What do you think? 
What will we see first, a 2D Mario or a 2D Zelda? I'd definitely welcome either with open arms. My gut feeling is we'll at least see one of the two by next year, maybe even both. I'm sure many ideas for both games have been circulating around Nintendo HQ for years, and whatever it is that ends up coming our way, I'm excited for the next adventure.